Hey, what's up? I'm at the St. Louis Arch, as you can see behind me, and we're doing the POTA, National Parks on the Air. It's October 8th, 2016, and I have not done a POTA thing all year long, which is kind of a shame. So I'm really sorry for that, everybody. But now I'm finally in the air with a few friends from the St. Louis Radio Club in the area around St. Louis. We've got WX5CW on CW and uh, November Delta 9 Echo taking a break from 40 meters single side man. And I almost forgot Kyle in zero KTK. Sorry, man. And I think we have a 20 meter antenna and a 40 meter antenna. And we're nestled just right under the shadow of the St. Louis Arch. As you can see, there's a lot of construction going on because they're redoing this whole section from the courthouse down to the arch. So this is gonna be a lot of fun. There's a whole lot of people out here. So ham radio and National Parks on the Air is getting a lot of exposure and that's really exciting. So stay tuned. Here is at National Parks on the Air from November 0, Sierra Sierra Charlie. Thanks for the context, uh, 73. So the operation is really simple. We have a 20 meter station and a 40 meter station. Right now, I think we set up the 20 meter for 40 meters so we can use a better antenna. Two stations here, a 100 watt amplifier and another is a QRP station. Um, and the idea is you just call CQ. CQ, 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 National Parks on the Air. National Parks on the Air from November 0, Sierra Sierra Charlie under the St. Louis Arch. Uh, November 0, Sierra Sierra Charlie under the St. Louis Gateway Arch at Park of the Inter November, Mexico, 1, 2, and listening for a call. And this is the designator. This is a bunch of uh, you know letters and numbers that just easily designates each of the parks from each other, so that you know it has an easy way to tell you what the park is in a database format. You also don't want to make it too much of a contest because a lot of people really actually want to know. And the point is, you know, to educate and entertain people about the you know National Park Service. So you want to tell them like this is the St. Louis Gateway Arch, and it's always good to do to inform people what it is, what we're doing, and all that. So. I just worked 150 some odd stations all in about two hours on National Parks on the Air. That was a ton of fun. If you don't know what National Parks on the Air is, uh, you've been living under a rock. But just in case that you don't and you have, National Parks on the Air is basically operating soda style, summits on the air, a special event, so to speak, at a national park. We're at the Jefferson Expansion National Memorial Gateway Arch, or the St. Louis Gateway Arch uh, in St. Louis, Missouri, which is considered a national park by the National Park Agency, or the, the what's it called? And there are lots and lots of different parks throughout the country that are uh, national parks. There's also national trails, like the Lewis and Clark Trail. There's also national historic sites, like battlefields. Um, St. Louis has a, has a site called Grant Park as well, that's a, um, you know, the home of Ulysses S. Grant when he lived here. And so the idea is you get on the air and you promote the National Park Centennial. Uh, at the same time, you promote ham radio as well as promote it to all the people that are walking around. There's been about like 13 or 14 people that have come up. Most of them ask like, how do we get to the arch? Because you can't exactly get to it from here. You have to go around to this church and get in there and whatever. But, you know, some people came in and said like, hey, what are you doing? What's this thing you're doing? And, you know, it's ham radio. And they're really cool. A lot of people come in and say, oh yeah, my crazy uncle did that. And he gets them here. The point is we're getting out, getting on the air to really celebrate the, the centennial of the National Park Service. So we're really having a lot of fun here. Um, probably some of the the most fun I've ever had at, on ham radio because we're activating a park, we're getting in front of a lot of people, um, and we're showing off what we're doing. Um, this, the team here in St. Louis had a, has a really great setup. We got a tent, this antenna, tripod, mast thing um, with dipole antennas, a really nifty connection system. It's, it's just really beautiful and a really beautiful weather. Thanks for watching and hope to work you from National Park uh, November Mexico 1-2 again. Thanks.